dear students welcome to the classroom today we are going to learn the new lesson of introduction to computers standard 5th lesson number 3 storage so dear students watch the video carefully dear students storage of data programs and information is one of the most important functions of a computer a computer can store large amount of data in its memory this data could be text pictures or even sounds you can use this stored data whenever you want the students there are two kinds of storage areas in a computer primary memory and secondary memory this can be clearly understood from this illustration primary memory the students primary memory is also known as main memory or internal memory there are two kinds of primary memory ram random access memory and rom read only memory random access memory the students ram is a temporary memory data programs or information is stored in ram in the form of electrical pulses hence anything stored in ram will remain stored there only as long as electric power is supplied to the computer if there is an interruption in the power supply or if you accidentally switch off the computer you will lose all the data stored in ram you cannot retrieve the lost data even if the power supply is restored or you switch on the computer again hence ram is a temporary memory in ram information is stored using bits binary digits 0 or 1 thus a bit can contain only two digits 0 or 1 this method of using only two digits is called binary system a number or a letter you enter using the keyboard is stored in ram using eight bits a group of eight bits is called a byte for example one character it could be a number or letter is equal to eight bits and 8 bits are is equal to 1 byte read only memory the students rom stores programs which tell the computer how to work for example when you switch on the computer it is rom that sends the necessary instructions to the cpu to get going as the name suggest programs in rom can only be read the instructions cannot be changed and they will not be lost even if there is an interruption in power supply or the computer is accidentally switched off secondary memory the students secondary memory is also known as external memory data stored in ram is in the form of electrical pulses and this data will remain stored only as long as the electric power is supplied to the computer you may lose all data if there is an interruption in power supply or if you accidentally switch off the computer some data or information is very important and so it needs to be stored on a permanent basis such information is stored in the secondary memory of a computer the most commonly used external storage devices are hard disk cd DVD USB flash drive hard disk the students the hard disk is a small magnetic disk enclosed in a sealed box called hard drive the hard disk drive is housed inside the CPU box the computer can read from or write on hard disk the hard disk stores all the information on its magnetic area and so information stored in the hard disk will not be erased even if there is an interruption in power supply or if the computer is switched off hence the hard disk is a permanent storage device cd the students the cd is a small disk which is inserted into the optical drive the optical drive is fixed in the cpu box the computer can read or write the cd using the optical drive the cd is a permanent storage device 
Any information stored in the CD can never be erased. The CD is removable but it cannot store more data than the hard disk. A CD is slower than the hard disk. DVD Dear students, nowadays DVD is more popular than CD. A DVD looks like a CD. And like the CD, a DVD is also inserted in the optical drive which is fixed inside the CPU box. A DVD can store more data than a CD. USB flash drive or pen drive Dear students, USB flash drive is a very small storage device which you can easily carry in your pocket. It is smaller, faster and can store more data. It can be plugged into any computer with a USB drive. So my dear students, in this video we have learned about storage. So watch the video carefully and check the community tab for exercise.